So for this month's Heath highlight, we are here at Lunaria in Corte Madera with the owner, Aaliyah Gaffney. This is one of my favorite places. Not only do I get my lights for all of my listings here, but also for my development projects and my personal home. We're not talking CB2, West Elm, every fixture looks the same. These are handcrafted, handpicked, creative lights that make your house a home. Let's meet Aaliyah and learn some of her magic. So not being a creative person myself, when I look around and I see the variety of styles that you have in here, I wonder where do you get your creative inspiration from? Every two years, for as long as I've been in this business, we get to go to Milan to a show called Euroluce. It's like Disneyland for designers. And you walk into these vendors' story of what they're like. And they all show- All lighting? All lighting. And then just looking around. I mean, you'd be surprised what seeing light falling on a tree in a field does to your inspiration. Okay, so don't kill me when I say this, but lots of people go online or to like an Ikea or a Home Depot to pick lights. That's not what you do here. You are so much more personal and thoughtful, which is, I believe, the way a lot of things should be. Talk to me about how you curate that experience for your clients. We do dimension, utility, price, and then aesthetic. Because every space is different. And while you might love something in your neighbor's house, it may not work for you. So our process helps the end user or the designer or even you, <laughs> come up with a solution that's going to work in the space. And when a fixture works in the space, it's always gonna be something that you'll love. And it's always successful. Like all things, trends come and go, right? And I'm assuming it's the same way in lighting. So if you were to kind of give someone advice on how to have style, but also something that style that would last, what, how would you steer them these days? Really, you wanna pick from what you love and then take your space into consideration and make it work. But let's talk specifics. Yeah. So this light, um, it's kind of similar to the one that we did for your mom. Yes. It's actually based on the one that we did for your mom. What lights like this do is they allow for a space that's big to be humanized. This brings the ceiling down without making it heavy. Design like anything is a reaction to what's going on in our world. And right now everybody wants comfort. Mm. So they want to feel cozy. And so cozy is a trend that you also think is going to be timeless. I think people will always look at their homes as a space to recluse in. And if you think about the idea, then not the fixture, then make the idea of the light work as the trend as opposed to the light itself. I love that. So everybody's on a budget to some extent, right? If I told you that I could only afford to redo lights in one or two of the rooms in my house. What do you think the most important rooms are to spend that money on or that one really special piece? Your powder room. It's the only room that your guests go to by themselves. It's why people go crazy in powder rooms. They go over the top. They're also small, so you can do nuts without spending a fortune. Your dining room. It's where you come together and gather. A lot of times people use it like three times a year spend a fortune on a dining table, chairs, a great light fixture, but you remember those moments. So later today after this, Aliyah and I are actually going into the city to a house in Pacific Heights where she will come around the entire house with me and pick out individual light fixtures for every single room to bring that house to life, to bring it current. So not only are, am I working with the stagers for the furniture and the painters and the et cetera, but Aaliyah comes in and she chooses every single light fixture for the entire house. And I will tell you, it is one of the most important things that you can do when getting a house ready or to make your own home feel like it's personally yours. I cannot recommend Lunaria and Aaliyah more.